This is a Buccaneer schooner twin axle caravan. Really is lovely condition. If I just walk you round, tow hitch, base of storing gas bottles, nice long window in the lounge area, alloy wheels, fence there for the fridge, and that's the hatch there for the toilet cassette to be removed. Losing light, I'm afraid it's evening, but around the back because it's a rear wash room. You can see it's a lovely long caravan. So, if we just go inside, it's a stable door, we've got the storage pockets. And then on entering you have a supply screen. It's lovely bright modern interior. Got the L shape seating area and that converts into a double bed. This bit here. I can't do it very well with one hand, but this slides out and then the cushions are laid on top to form the bed. Double glazing all the way around with fly screen. Sorry, fly screen, and is it from the bottom? Yes, it is. And blackout blinds. Storage cupboards above. Got the space there for the wine glasses and bottles. It's nice and solid, all the cupboards. Little Sony or Sony. Looks like a cassette player. Yeah. Probably more high tech than that. And again. Oh, there's the CD player. It's got a 10 CD changer. A bit of storage underneath the seats as well. Like so. One over there. And also under this one as well. So I have to lift that up a door with double cut on the door in the cupboard with all the caravan information. And just here I've got water, levels, sockets, heating controls, a couple of shelves and a clock. Place for storing cups and plates once you're travelling. And some more storage there. The kitchen has got a country leisure four ring gas hob. Nice and clean. And also a country leisure grill and pan. Got a nice clean oven. And pan storage beneath. And next to that is the Electrolux fridge with ice box. All nice good condition. And a nice sink with drainer as well. Above the sink, you can see that is the microwave. The side of the fridge is the cupboard with some more storage racks which you are actually accessed like so. A bit different. And then next to that one is the table storage cupboard. <coughs> Excuse me. And there's the free standing table in there. And that can be put up between the two lounge seats. Alternatively it can be used outside. And here is the traumatic heater that runs on LPG or 220 volts. And above that, the hanging wardrobe cupboard is very dark now. Just see, <coughs> excuse me, the hanging rail and the shel shelf. Now, what I didn't mention was the caravan has actually got air conditioning, and there's the domestic air conditioning unit above. If we can move on. 
space for a TV here. And that can be watched from either the living area or from the bedroom area. And this can be sectioned off because you've got a little blind that pulls down and also a sliding door. So moving into the bedroom area, we've got the nice large roof light. Again, a nice lot of storage around the top. And a couple of little shelves either side. And then this is the bed. <coughs> Excuse me. The bed also has storage beneath. And it looks like we've got the mats underneath. And also a water tank. Then opposite the bed is a vanity cupboard. Nest and more cupboards by the side for shoes, which is very handy. That's lovely. And then just above the sink, sorry, above the cupboard, there's a mirror. There's a cupboard there. It's a lovely lot of storage. Moving on into the shower room. We've got this lovely circular shower. Another little mirror. Vanity sink. Cupboard beneath. Sorry about the light. We've got the Tetford electric toilet. Swivel toilet. Shelves, the cupboard, another storage cupboard with hanging rail, above. cupboard beneath, a couple of little drawers. There's just so much storage. This caravan, a few shelves, and a speaker. It's handy when you're having a shower. And again, another long mirror. It's also handy. Little look on the shower door. And another cupboard. There is just so much storage and so many cupboards, it's amazing. See, it's a nice long caravan moving back into the bedroom area. Lovely condition as well.